Right then, so it turns out, Tiny Rebel Urban IPA only lasted the night. <laughs> Three kegs at Halloween party. So, I've got no ale, I've got no ale. Thankfully, Beer Hut, big love, uh, had a sale on, crazy sale. So I bought a caribou slobber and something else, but you gotta wait for that, a cheeky little number. I only bought it because the picture looked good and then Red Dogs told me it's apparently it's one of the nicest IPAs ever. I'm gonna do that on his kit because I want it to turn out great, I want it to be my Christmas drink. But today, we're in the shed, get a caribou slobber on the go, try and get some better footage this time. Again, I'm working away. Number two, I ain't got beer in hand. This was meant to be a grain to glass video. Whilst I was recording, racking it into the keg, I wasn't paying attention to what I was doing, and I got trouble in the keg. Not a lot, but I carved it up. I had a couple of pints at the weekend on Sunday, and it was looking murky as. I'm talking like mud. So if you can leave me any comments about how I can sort that out, please, please do, because I'm so annoyed, because it was tasting amazing. Uh, in the trial jar. I'm hoping I'm just going to leave it to settle for a couple of weeks in the keg and then I'll come back and do a full taste test. Kit, kit wise, absolutely fantastic. I think it costs about 15 quid normally, something like that. Three types of hops in there, one at 60 minute, 30 minute, 15. I did a 90, no sorry, 60 minute mash and 60 minute boil. Uh, and dumps barged for about 15 minutes, gave it a good stir. Came out at 5.4%, so good strength as well. And it was tasting so sweet, it was looking clean as. I'm absolutely destroyed that um, I got that in there. What also happened, I had some grain left over, some bits and pieces from when I tried to make a black IPA back when. So I thought, sod it. I did another brew day and I whacked a Christmas ale I've made. I don't know if it's gonna be an IPA or dark ale. Well, I'll have to ask the expert Red Dog to tell me. Uh, but that's gonna go, that, that went straight on top of the trub from the caribou slobber. It's almost fermented out now. Uh, so I'm kegging that up at the weekend. I'll get full grain to glass on that next week. I'm looking forward to that. Hopefully that should come out about 5.7 there or thereabouts. When my first black IPA attempt came out really weak, so I'm, I'm buzzing to see how this comes out. Uh, also had a little bit of it's a little bit of seasonal kind of stuff in there, a bit of cinnamon, a little bit of vanilla, so hopefully it's gonna work. Uh, but without a taste test, still I would highly recommend that caribou slobber kit. I've tasted it twice with Red Dog turned out amazing. Mine's gonna turn out amazing when I sort out this crap in the bottom of my keg, even if it's to draw off 10 pints. Um, so yeah, get involved with it, get yourself on Beer Orc and give it a go. As always, big love.